On season 5 of Cobra K, the franchise reunited the Karate Kid 3 cast, with both Sean Cannon and Robin Lively reprising their roles as Mike Barnes and Jessica Andrews on the Netflix series. While Kanan's return was announced ahead of season 5's debut on Sept. 9, Lively's appearance on the show was a surprise for longtime fans of the films. This season, they joined other returning stars, Yuji Okamoto, Thomas Ian Griffith, and Martin Cove, as chosen Taguchi, Terry Silver, and John Kreese, respectively, as well as Ralph Macchio and William Zabka, who continue to lead the Cobra Kai series as on and off again rivals Daniel LaRusso and Johnny Lawrence. Sean is fantastic in the show by the way, Okamoto says. While speaking to E.T., he, Machio and their other co-stars gush about the latest crop of Karate Kid performers to appear on the series. Warning, spoilers for Cobra Kai Season 5, Mike first shows up in Episode 3, as Daniel is forced to call upon old friends, er, enemies, in order to strengthen his numbers in the ongoing battle with Terry for control of the valley. Still traumatized about the way Mike treated him over 30 years ago, Daniel is quick to assume that Mike is still a goon, but it turns out he is now just a furniture store owner and very apologetic for the things he did back then. Like the other returning OGs, it's not long before Kanan's character gets sucked into the drama at hand with the 55-year-old actor showing off his impressive fighting skills. Shortly after Daniel reunites with Mike, Chosen starts throwing punches and he and Mike throw down in the furniture store. It was great. I mean, he came in like every older OG guy came in, and they just do a great job, Machio says. And after his furniture store is burned down, Mike makes a surprise return in the finale, first to attack Daniel outside of the runaway limo before being convinced to join him in Johnny's fight against Terry and take down the Cobra Kai dojo. In fact, that limo throwdown with Daniel, Mike, Chosen and Johnny happens to be one of Machio's favorite scenes of season 5. Outside the limo and me knowing the insanity and the guys want to just get on the horses and a beer is thrown at my head, he recalls, noting it's very Cobra Kai, leading up to such a big climax that closes out the episode and season. What's also fun about that moment is that it's the first time Johnny and Mike officially meet since Sabka wasn't actually in Karate Kid 3. Johnny doesn't know who this Mike Barnes is, the actor says, sharing how fun it was to then have Johnny, Chosen and Mike team up especially given their collective past with Daniel. They have no history, they have no bond. It's hysterical that these three guys tormented LaRusso for all this time and now, are all together, Zabka continues, with Machio quipping, the three nemeses. Meanwhile, Griffith says it was an honor being on set with all the other OGs. Our paths haven't crossed in years, he says. So, to come on and just be able to catch up as human beings and see where they're at as artists and then be able to try to create something that's gonna be nostalgic and fun but also rise to the level we want, it was special. The actor then credits the creators, Josh Heald, John Hurwitz, and Hayden Schlossberg, for tapping into the colors and the dimensions of all these characters. They all can pop up and you can root for all of them, 